Well, here's a question for you. Are you getting enough protein and calcium in your diet? Well, we are all about to find out this morning. Joining us this morning is Robert Ferguson of Diet Free Life, a leading voice for weight loss and living diet free. And today he's here to talk to us about protein and calcium as part of proper nutrition and how it works to keep the pounds away. Hey, Robert, good to see you. Well, it's good to be here. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet Shaking you as well. Shaking because you are my <laughs> okay. friend this morning talking about keeping the pounds away. Oh, yeah, 100%. Come protein is really your friend when it comes to those macronutrients. When you compare protein to fat and carbohydrates, protein boosts your metabolism more than those two. Does it really? Yes, and protein also helps it whereas you're not hungry as soon compared to carbs and fat. Mm -hmm. Protein really is our friend. I love that. Okay, so after a workout, I hear, make sure as soon as you work out that you eat some protein. Is this truth or myth? Tell me it's true well, because truth I have <laughs> so much protein after a workout. Well, the truth in that is that protein, when it's available in your body, it is the building blocks of muscle. Okay. And muscle on a cellular level actually burns more calories than any other cell in your body. So the more lean muscle tissue you, ha you have, the more fat you can burn. So you're burning more calories. All right, which so is that, a good thing. That would be true then. Yes. That'd be awesome. Unfortunately, though, most people aren't getting an adequate amount of protein. Ah. So we're falling short in that, even though we believe we're getting protein, right? Because when you look at, you know, this nice display yeah. here, you'll get your protein in your eggs, and you'll get protein in your yogurt, and you'll get protein, you know, across the board. Unfortunately, all protein is not created equal. So if you look at the protein, for example, that's in this salad, right? Mm -hmm. That would be the avocado? Well, you have protein in, even in the tomatoes and the leafy greens. Oh, you have okay. protein in the nuts. But uh, what people don't realize is that there's more fat in the nuts. There's more fat in the avocado. Mm. Okay? So the protein, again, is going to be a little bit low. However, eggs are a great source of protein. All right, now all proteins are not created equal. No, I know not. this. All right, <laughs> what about somebody like me? You know, I'm married, I have three children, I'm always on the go. Ooh. What can I eat? and what can I consume that's protein rich that I can take with me? And that's quality protein too. Okay, well we have something that's actually good to the taste and is friendly to your waist. All right, Ooh, it's called. you're trying to run <laughs> too, I like that, all right. It's what called a Fit Pro Protein. Okay, See, that's like, what this is that's here. That's these shakes. Okay. Now if you look at that shake, yeah, there you go. right? Let me give you one. And if you look at this plate where you have the chicken, yeah. the chicken is a great source of protein equally this shake gives you that same amount or benefit of protein without the carbs. Really? It's absolutely delicious. Mm -hmm. It's uh, friendly on the waistline. You can drink it. It's lactose free for those who are concerned with that. It is soy free and it's also gluten free. Mm. So this is really the freshest, ready to go, ready to drink protein shake on the market. It's a go-to shake for me. I love that. I've already had two sips of it. That yes. tells you how good it is. And I it's will be great. drinking all of this. Okay. <laughs> Let's toast first. Let's well, toast there first. There you go. There's toast. To good health. Thank you so Thank much you. for joining us. Really good information. And if you want more information on Fit Pro Ready to Drink Protein Shake, simply visit the website. It's fitproprotein.com.